Hi, my name is Whitney Flynn for the National Weather Service Office of Water Prediction and National Water Center, and today I'll be presenting an overview of the 2019 Spring Flood Outlook Story Map Journal. This Story Map Journal is a dynamic web mapping application portraying flood risk for the 2019 spring season in the continental United States. NOAA's network of 122 weather forecast offices, 13 river forecast centers, National Water Center, and other national centers nationwide assess this risk, summarized here at the national scale. This risk information is based on NOAA's Ensemble Stream Flow Prediction, or ESP, forecasts, which are generated for thousands of river and stream forecast locations across the country, depicting the three-month risk of minor, moderate, and major river flooding. This spring flood outlook is reflective of forecast conditions from March to May of 2019. The sections below quantify river flood risk based on the river location having a 50% or more likelihood of exceeding minor, moderate, or major flood levels. The National Weather Service, in coordination with local officials, defines flood levels for each of its river forecast locations based on the impact over a given area. Portions of the upper Mississippi Valley and the plains of the Missouri River Basin experienced accumulated snowfall much higher than normal compared to previous years. This combined with highly saturated soil conditions and deeply frozen ground has set the stage for widespread flooding to continue this spring. Heavy rainfall late February brought widespread moderate to major flooding across much of the mid to lower Mississippi River basins and its tributaries, which has led to much above normal soil moisture and water storage conditions. This story map journal provides an in-depth narrative organized into sections in a scrolling side panel. The beauty of this application is that each section presents a new extent of a map, video, image, or piece of web content with associated narrative text in a side panel. As we scroll through the following sections, you'll notice the map moves with me and zooms into the particular location that I am referring to. Location names through the narrative have been hyperlinked, so clicking automatically zooms into that particular location. These sections have been organized by region as well as by flood category. Thank you for watching. The information presented, as well as additional information regarding areas of low flow risk, water supply, Alaska flood potential, and hypoxia outlook, are discussed in the 2019 National Hydrologic Assessment online as seen here. To be prepared, every American should know their flood risk and what to do before, during, and after a flood event. For the latest information on your current flood risk, visit weather.gov for official watches and warnings. For detailed hydrologic conditions, visit water.weather.gov.